Hello everybody, getting ready to do uh, chapter 10 of SAT Math Level 2 Preparation. And chapter 10 is about parametric equations, definitions, and eliminating the parameter will be our objectives here. you got two points on your notebook and ten points on your class worksheet. Have that out. Student name, date, and period. Due date for onlineers and home students. And let's get in right to page one here. At times, it is convenient to express a relationship between x and y in terms of a third variable, usually denoted by a parameter t. For example, parametric equations x equals x of t or y equals y of t can be used to locate a particle on the plane at various times t. So t for time. Uh, example eight, uh, A here, graph the parametric equation. So we have this x equals 3t plus 4, and then y equals t minus 5. So select mode, we're going to use on your graphing calculator. Select mode on your graphing calculator, and select PAR, par. Enter 3t plus 4 into x1t, and then t minus 5 into y1t. The standard window uses 0 for t min and 6.28 or 2 pi for t max, along with the usual ranges for x and y. The choice for 0 for t min reflects the interpretation of t as time, with, so here will be our graph here, 3t plus uh, 4, and then y1 t would be t minus 5. And this is what you get way. So uh, if you use trace, the cursor will begin at t equals 0, which is here, where x, y equals 4, negative 5. As t in, uh, in, increases uh, from 0, the graph traces out a line that ascends as it moves right. It may be possible to eliminate the parameter and to rewrite the equation in familiar xy form. Just remember that the resulting equation may consist of points not on the graph of the original set of equations. So that's what a parameter will do. And then for example b here, we have x equals t squared, then y equals 3t squared plus 1. Eliminate the parameter and sketch the graph. So substituting x for t squared in the second equation results in y equals 3x plus 1, which is the equation of a line with a slope of 3 and a y-intercept of 1. However, the original parametric equations indicate that x is greater than or equal to 0 and y is greater than or equal to 1, since t squared cannot be negative. Thus, the proper way to indicate this set of points without the parameter is as follows. y equals 3x plus 1. So we start here. This is 3x plus 1 here. And then x would be greater than or equal to 0. So we move off in this direction like that. The graph is indicated in the figure. So example C here, sketch the graph of the parametric equations. X equals 4 cosine theta, and then Y equals 3 sine theta. Replace the parameter theta with T and enter the pair of equations. The graph has the shape of an ellipse, elongated horizontally. Here's our major axis here of our ellipse, as shown in the figure. It is possible to eliminate the parameter theta by dividing the first equation by 4, and the second equation by 3, squaring each and then adding the equations together. So here we have x over 4 quad e squared equals cosine squared theta up here. And we have y over 3 quad e squared equals sine squared theta for this one. So we end up from that, we end up when we add them together, x squared plus 16 plus y squared over 9 equals cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta equals 1. This should look familiar, by the way. Here, x squared over 16 plus y squared over 9 equals 1. 
is the equation of an ellipse with its center at the origin a equals 4 and b equals 3 since negative 1 is less than or equal to cosine theta which is less than or equal to 1 and negative 1 is less than or equal to sine theta less than or equal to 1 negative 4 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to 4 and negative 3 is less than or equal to y less than or equal to 3 from the two parametric equations so this gives us our kind of like our our example here that we move over into this actual situation here in this case the parametric equations do not limit the graph obtained by removing the parameter so we end up with an ellipse from that one and that is uh, uh, lesson 10 uh, SAT math level 2 prep uh, lesson that covered uh, parametric equations animated PowerPoint math video ALL.com for uh, review packets and other course materials or questions thank you very much